Caleb Williams, of course, the USC quarterback, former Oklahoma quarterback. Quite a spat over the weekend. He came out and Mike Farrell uh, said that uh, Caleb Williams' dad says that OU fans drove his son away. And he said that his reaction to this is that it is beyond ridiculous that Caleb Williams was gone and entering the portal and not expecting Oklahoma to get another quarterback is laughable. Now, Caleb Williams responded to this and said, do you want to take this down? The fans and my old teammates are the reason uh, the reason on why I almost stayed. Not, not the best grammar, but regardless, he... And I do believe that. I do believe that the fans are a reason why he almost stayed. But by saying that you almost stayed, that's letting everybody know that you were absolutely leaning towards going to USC. Right? You you signed up to go play for Lincoln Riley. I don't think anybody's upset at the fact that you left after all that. So uh, he did say that, and then it came back to this. Mike jumped in and said, more than happy to have you and your dad on for interview to share your side. All I can go on is quotes given to others. To which Caleb Williams responded, nobody wants to do one of your stupid high school interviews. We aren't driving up your views talking about the past and something that isn't true. I'm the one that made the decision, and I have my reasons on why. Talking about more than happy to have you, trust me, I know you would. And he puts a laughy face. I don't understand why... Caleb Williams would even respond to this. If he does not believe that Mike is a legitimate reporter, a legitimate journalist, why would you even comment? I, that, that's what I don't understand. Uh, and a lot of people want to jump in and, oh, yeah, yeah, you got him. You got him. Uh, they're all talking bad about Mike now. Like, Bottom line is this. like Mike was just offering his opinion on something, and there was no reason for Caleb Williams to jump in regardless of whether it was true or not. Why start a beef with somebody? And and the reason he could do this is he's the number one quarterback in the country. I mean, it's, you know, it, at least was in the transfer portal, all that. He, he's got a big name, et cetera. But this, this lets me know uh, kind of the person that Caleb Williams is. There was no reason to attack Mike over this. Uh, the reports are all over the place. Like, unless you were going to go comment on everybody, why did you pick his? Just because it had a graphic? I mean, it's, it's just ridiculous. Uh, I, don't, I don't like the way that that was handled. I don't like when athletes do this. Uh, yes, I understand wanting to make sure that you clear the air or whatever, but you can be nicer than that. There's just no reason to be rude because Mike wasn't rude. It just irritates me. And it's not like I'm buddies with Mike. I don't even know him on a personal level. I'm just a little irritated when uh, when people do this. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com, and if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter, at GaryWCE, at ChrisBGiannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com, or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.